Have you ever wondered why narcissists seem kind to everyone except you? Let's delve into the public persona of a narcissist. Imagine a person who exudes charm, intelligence and success. This is the mask a narcissist wears for the world to see. They meticulously craft this persona as a beacon of admiration and validation, fueling their inflated sense of self-worth. To uphold this image, they project an aura of kindness and generosity. Whether offering a helping hand, volunteering their time, or engaging in acts of philanthropy, they ensure their actions amplify their public image. This is not merely for show, but a calculated strategy to enhance their reputation and assert their perceived superiority. So to the outside world, a narcissist may appear as a model citizen, but what happens behind closed doors? Behind the closed doors, the charming exterior of a narcissist often fades away. The charisma and kindness they project publicly often give way to a more critical, demanding and emotionally abusive demeanor towards those they are closest to. This stark contrast might seem baffling, but it's deeply rooted in their insecurity and desperate need for control. When the stage lights of the outside world dim and the curtain of privacy draws, the narcissist's true colors begin to show. They may start to belittle their partners, pick apart their friends and even emotionally manipulate their family members. These close relations often bear the brunt of a narcissist's most unkind behaviors, serving as an emotional punching bag for the narcissist's insecurities. This shift from public charm to private cruelty is not arbitrary. It's a calculated attempt to maintain control and protect their inflated self-image, revealing a deep-seated fear of vulnerability and rejection. But why do narcissists treat outsiders more favorably than those closest to them? Several factors contribute to the seemingly contradictory behavior of narcissists. Let's delve into them. Firstly, there's the fear of exposure. Narcissists are terrified that their true nature will be revealed if they act abusively towards outsiders. Their public image, carefully constructed and painstakingly maintained, could crumble, leaving them vulnerable to criticism and rejection. Secondly, the limited emotional investment. Narcissists prioritize their public persona over their personal relationships. They invest less emotional energy in their close connections, which makes them more susceptible to outbursts and mistreatment. Then, there's a sense of entitlement. Narcissists believe they deserve special treatment and are not bound by the same rules as others. They may view their close relationships as transactional, expecting constant admiration and unquestioning loyalty. A lack of empathy is another critical factor. Narcissists struggle to understand and respond to the emotions of others. They may dismiss the feelings of their loved ones, prioritizing their own needs and desires. Lastly, the yearning for power and control. Narcissists crave power and control over their environment. They may use their close relationships to assert their dominance and manipulate others to fulfill their needs. These factors, combined, create a volatile cocktail that fuels the disparity in a narcissist's behavior. If you find yourself in a relationship with a narcissist, it's crucial to protect yourself from their harmful behaviors. Being in a relationship with a narcissist can be draining and emotionally challenging. But the good news is, you can protect yourself from their harmful behaviors. Here's how. Firstly, establish clear boundaries. Decide what you will and will not tolerate. Don't be afraid to assert these boundaries and be prepared to enforce them if they are crossed. Remember, you have a right to your own space, both physically and emotionally. Secondly, avoid engaging in emotional reactions. Narcissists thrive on drama. They use your emotional reactions to manipulate and control you. So the next time they try to draw you into their chaos, stay calm, remain detached, and avoid getting sucked into their manipulative tactics. Thirdly, don't hesitate to seek support. Surround yourself with friends and family who offer validation and encouragement. They can provide a much needed perspective and remind you that you're not alone in this. Also, consider seeking professional help from a therapist specializing in narcissistic abuse. They can equip you with tools and strategies to deal with the situation effectively. Fourthly, prioritize your well-being. Engage in activities that bring you joy and nurture your self-esteem. Don't let the narcissist's behavior define your worth. You are more than their perception of you. Lastly, evaluate the relationship. Assess if it's causing more harm than good. Remember, your well-being matters and you deserve to be treated with respect and kindness.